Lebium is an Italian design company based on the island of Sardinia and in Spain. We provide eco-fabrics and vegan skin for design and fashion sectors, introducing a new application of waste uh, in a more ecological way, thanks to bio-based uh, binders and also use a high percentage of cork uh, residue. I came across this idea because I paid attention to a specific industrial uh, sector which is highly contribute to the global warming. In fact, the fashion industry is the second most polluting activity in the world because it is responsible of 20% of the global waste of water and 10% of greenhouse emissions. So right now we are at the point where um, there is not backward step. We must give a quick response and seek uh, a change not only in the products we consume but also in the manufacturing process and the use of natural resources. On the other hand, cork is a noble material that is extracted from the cork oak which, uh, which works as CO2 sink uh, it cleans the air and it's important it's harvesting because uh, the more you harvest, the faster it cleans the air. So the implementation of this powder provides a much more animal-friendly alternative and a greener option for companies that um, they have to choose which kind of product they, they would like to buy due to its origin and also processes applied. Avoid from the beginning CO2 additional emission since the residues doesn't need to be treated before its uses. During the co-creation with textile and uh, cork technician, I started a documental investigation on bio-based fabrics and, um, and also patent research to guarantee the state of innovation among textile industries. And tests conducted with various techniques such as nanonebulization, lamination, coupling, spray, fooling, um, have shown advantage and also restriction of the state of the material at the beginning of the project. From there, through laboratory practice, the performance of the material has been improved. I think that all the industrial sector which provide products and service for people have to embrace creativity and also non-conventional thinking when creating a new concept for consumer goods. I believe that art and technology collaboration are currently the perfect match to boost innovation in every sector. In my case, I have the chance to focus on production process learning by doing and also giving to technicians uh, all different uh, ways to look at new, uh, new materials, uh, what we could do with different resources and blended production techniques. In the development of the project, I pay attention to important aspects that became the core values of the entire project. These are the environmental sustainability. In fact, Lebiu fabrics are made from pork stopper waste and bio binders in water solution. So we get a biomaterial with similar properties to animal leather, but totally vegan. Another one is the empowerment of the rural economy. We strongly believe in local community, helping company that works with cork to reinvent themselves and be more sustainable. We buy cork from a small and middle industry uh, that, for example, have difficult to dispose of this, uh, this waste. And uh, we create local employment and rebooting some industry that uh, nowadays are stuck in the past. And the last one is the cultural heritage. We think that it is important to protect our heritage as we pretend to protect uh, our environment. The old technique of producing cork goods introduced by artists and over the years became the identity of, uh, in my case, of my land, but uh, it can be applied to different lands. It transmits such as va social values, uh, such as inclusion, respect, uh, and the know-how that is handed from a generation to another. So it's important to keep this uh, heritage alive with the support of the latest technology. So after several tests and a lot of patience, I came across with three production uh, lines made by cork residue. One is the cork skin, is a bio skin made of cork particle and eco binders that keeps uh, the aesthetic appearance of real leather, plus the back that has a spongy effect uh, um, that uh, resembles the back of the animal leather. Uh, no other synthetic leather in the market has such a characteristic since uh, the back part uh, is usually in fabrics. Then the second one is a neobook, which is a new vegetal nubook. It imitates nubook in texture but made from uh, bioresources, so we find uh, a different way to process these kind of particles. And the last one is nanocork, is a natural finish that can be applied directly on garment using the minimum amount of water and chemical products. In this way, proposing a new type and much more sustainable and ad hoc finish process where it produces only what is needed uh, without overproduction. The mist of cork particle penetrates into the fiber, improving its resistance and giving this uh, kind of uh, uh, biodenim effect. 
and it's a great alternative also to give uh, a second life to clothes and also recover some clothes that um, have been damaged during the production process in textile factories. So the material in all these variants is uh, lighter and more resistant to rubbing and to cut. The deposition of particles in several layers and also in different percentage improve its mechanical performance, making uh, this material suitable for uh, footwear and clothing. For example, the pigment adheres better to the particles and allows the greater variety of coloration. And also the production process is faster because uh, there is no need to extract moisture from the particle and uh, stabilize them before its use. The new cork materials are aiming to decrease the carbon footprint of fashion and design industry and preventing also the global warming. It will decrease also the significantly the production of real leather, which is good for our health but also for the environment since uh, of intensive farming is responsible of 20% of the total CO2 in the world. Currently, we are patenting and acquiring eco-certificates to be on market at the beginning of 2021. And at the same time, we are still improving the sustainability of the material. So I highly encourage designers to focus on new production cycle, uh, also with the help of uh, the latest technology, in order to generate a new eco-consciousness and change the actual fashion model into a more sustainable and ethical system.